So first is to test and see if she'll go on her own. She will not. Not burn myself. Right. Yeah, see, if I tried this myself already, I'd be a creek because I would have just been like right on it. <laughs> yep. You can go bump and bump, but you don't want to get so much heat. See, it's picking up steam already. Yeah. So. Camera's catching it too. Yep. I've had one guy do the same. He's like, oh my god, that's burning my paint. No, it's just freaking taking the moisture off. Alright. Bang. And give her a test. Hey guys, Troy here at Titan Off Road. Be sure to subscribe and check out more cool videos. Hey. See what I'm saying? It mm -hmm. works so nice. You want to hear how I learned this? Changing the ones on my hood, it going stainless on those. Mm -hmm. I broke two of these in a row trying to get it out. So I went and visited my buddy at a body shop right next to the Dodge Jeep Chrysler dealer right up the road a couple miles. Mm -hmm. And uh, anyways, little Matt helped me out. And it took him like, he made me look so foolish. He's like, bing. Bing. I'm like, are you kidding me? That easy. And <laughs> after that, this method has been the go-to. That's why I'm here to have somebody who knows what he's doing <laughs> show me because that's what's the best the, way. Yep. Yeah, and what's the what's the old saying? A uh, smart man learns from his mistakes. A wise man learns from everyone else's. Yeah. <laughs> Learn from my mistake. I had to be the fool to break a few things. You're Donnie Don't. <laughs> exactly. So on black, a little more of a, just, yeah, you just gotta test her a few times. All right. Now, how many get, how many can be loose before we have to start worrying about the alignment of the vehicle, of the door? You can loosen all four. So what happens is on the inside of the door is a plate. Mm -hmm. As soon as you take the bolt out, the plate drops right now. It's stuck right there. So that's why she reminded me, don't back out too far so that plate moves at all. Just break the seal is what I'm doing right now. Just breaking the seal, so backing them out just enough to separate the paint seal. Right. And then stop. Now, what the tricky part is always, when somebody's holding the door, the glue on the inside, because they use a crap load of Loctite on the inside of this, sometimes it cools off enough and melts and re-grabs, so then when you go to twist it, Again, with someone holding the door, it doesn't want to move, and you got to do this all over again. Gotcha. So just so you got to find the sweet spot between taking it out enough that you don't uh, it doesn't re-adhere, yeah. and so much that the plate drops. You got it exactly. So just a tiny bit. Having done it, like I said, like you mentioned, having done this a few times really helps. That's how you know. Don't yep. fight it. Let the torch do the work. Sometimes it helps to turn the torch. I was pointing it a little bit down, so now the um, Loctite on the top might not have melted. So. Mm -hmm. Usually like a 10 or 12 count does it. I have seen them a little trick stickier like this one. Is that in Mississippi's or Hippopotami? <laughs> <laughs> Definitely Mississippi's is going off in my head. There we go. Last one. loose yep it takes a lot less time than sitting there and digging the paint out of this so something else to keep in mind you're using a razor blade in that method and it's really easy to slip off the side and then you actually take mm -hmm. the paint off and damage the paint on the hint itself